All right, so I am back again. I'm like cranking out all of these since I'll be busy the next couple of days, but we are going to be looking at Libra. So all my Libra or cross watchers, this is your reading. We are going to see what is going on with you. Another one, um, another reading with chakras. So, Libra, we have refusing to see. Base chakra, which is root chakra, dealing with stability and everyday necessities. Um, and then we have third chakra, dealing with communication. Communication, speaking. Hmm. I don't know why the last two, Libra and um, I just did Cancer. Has a lot of chakras here. We have the throat chakra, fifth chakra here again. So heavy on something dealing with communication. All right, so we have fifth chakra. Um, Deceit and the thinking man in reverse. Then we have Sagittarius, Gemini, and I don't trust you. Libra, what is going on here? All right, so we have two cards dealing with communication, throat chakra. So there's some issue with communication here. I don't know if it's on your part or the part of the other person. Um, it could be on yours, possibly not wanting to speak up about something that you know about somebody or something. Um, because we have refusing to see here. So it's kind of like you're turning a blind eye, like not wanting to address something. And I really don't know what the situation with that would be but you're blocking it out. You're acting like it doesn't exist. Um, we have the deceit card here and I don't trust you. So, you don't wanna think about it. Like, and you don't wanna think about it with the thinking man in reverse. Like you're not, it's kinda of like you're just, letting things be and not speaking up about it 
I don't know if you're with in a relationship with someone and you know this person's not good for you, but you're afraid to communicate for some reason. So you block it out and act like it doesn't exist. And you don't trust this person is what it's saying here. So it could be a Sagittarius or a Gemini um, that you're involved with and something occurred to where you don't trust this person. And it could be that you live with this person and they provide you stability of some sort. So maybe that's why you just refuse to see, put up with it because it's kind of like you kind of rely on this person to help you out financially. And, um, you know, it could be giving you a place to stay. That's kind of heavy on what I'm picking up. Like they offer you stability in residence, but they are doing some shady stuff that you may know about and you don't want to be with them. This is, okay, this is kind of difficult. And that could be why you don't want to speak up because if you feel in your mind that if you speak up, this person may kick you out and you will have nowhere to go. So it's kind of like you don't have your voice to speak. You don't know what to say to this person or to how to bring it up because you're thinking about like, I need my security. And it's not, I know it sounds like you're using somebody, but it's kind of like you don't want to create waves if you don't have to. This one is very, let me pull it. This is really difficult because I'm really not sure if this is somebody you're in a relationship with or just someone that you are around. They could be hiding money or taking your money. They could even be using you for stability and you just are not sure how to like bring that up. I have to get another card. Get another card. <laughs> we have the first chakra card that came out again. So we have two. We have two of the base chakras or the root chakra and two of the throat chakra. So someone here is relying on someone for financial stability or some type of residence. And you're, someone is afraid. I'm not going to say you because I really don't know at this point. Someone's afraid to speak up about what it is that is going on. They're refusing to see. So there could be some stuff going on that this person's being deceitful about. Maybe it could be on how they're getting their money. This one's getting some extra because this one's hard to like pick up on. We have door to romance. I'm getting another one. And again, we have another chakra, seventh chakra. Let me see, because I get the intuition chakra and the seventh chakra, crown chakra. Higher consciousness. So this is dealing with you knowing something, but refusing to see. Door to romance. So maybe you thought that being with this person was going to be like all love and you found that this person is, there's their shady person and you guys have hostilities towards each other. So it wasn't that romantic thing that you thought it was going to turn into and there's issues with communication and there's issues with money. Someone could be using someone for money here or a place to stay or something dealing with like the necessities transportation cars something and someone is not refusing is refusing to see the things that they already know that's what i'm picking up from this and it could have something to do with money 
because this person is hiding money and it's saying deceit. So someone is possibly using you for money and you're just choosing not to see it because you want you want to have romance with this person. You want to be with them. But it's kind of like it's a fairy tale. And it's an emotional thing for you. <sighs> Libra, like, if this is you and you are with someone and you suspect that you don't trust them, you do not need to be with them. If you don't trust somebody, either communicate what that is that you don't trust about them so you could possibly work on it if it's not something too severe. But there's something serious going on with communication here and stability. Those are the main issues as to why this is continuing to progress in a negative way is what it looks like. Because I feel like somebody is using you for money or a place to stay and you don't trust them, but yet you don't want to create waves. So you choose not to address it. So um, if this made sense to you, please let me know. If you want to know more, also let me know because I kind of want to see myself what is going on with this situation because it's some heavy stuff here. Um, but just really think about this person and really ask yourself if they are somebody that you need to have around you on a romantic level. Because hostilities can create all types of issues. And the hostilities that are created is possibly because you question this person about their motives. And they continue to try and deceive you. And it starts arguments. So you've kind of learned to not speak up because you don't want to have a fight. And it could be that you're trying to... That you may not just be refusing to see. You may be trying to distance yourself from this person. But it's hard to let them leave not because I wouldn't say that you're weak and you just have to have somebody but it could be other things that maybe you fear what can happen because you already don't trust this person so you don't know what the repercussions could be but just really pray about it and meditate and figure out what it is that you need to do because you have the answers you just have to really just Think about it and see it for what it is instead of trying to block it out. So um, Libra, that is all. I just had to say that extra stuff at the end because I, I kind of feel like this is a little like bad situation to be in. But just pray about it, meditate, and everything else will work itself out.